Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix Sims 4 is not launching on your uh, PC. So the first thing what you need to do here, you need to open up the app or Steam, go to library, and then what you need to do here is to press on the, uh, these three little dots here and then press repair. So what you need to do here is to verify integrity of the game files. So maybe you have some corrupted files that need to, that you need to be fixed. So just press repair, uh, repair, wait for a couple of minutes and then try again. And if the problem persists, then uh, what you need to do here is to clear your EA uh, app cache. And on the top left corner, you should see menu here, uh, go to uh, help and then go to and press on app recovery and clear your app cache and then the game uh, or app will restart and then you need to look if the problem persists or not and if the pro problem persists uh, uh, another thing that you can do here is to uh, update your gpu driver so depending on what GPU you're using a uh, emd or uh, nvidia so if you're using nvidia there is a geforce experience app it's completely free. you can download it completely for free from uh, official uh, NVIDIA website and what you need to do here is to go to drivers uh, check for updates and if there is an update you need to download it and uh, install it and restart your computer and then you need to look if the problem persists or not and if the problem persists then what you need to do here is to open up task manager and all the tasks related to a uh, sims or your app that you're running EA or Steam as you can see here there is EA background app and end all the related tasks and then uh, go to your uh, basically app where you're playing the game and then you need to run as an administrator and if the problem persists then you need to go to properties um, go to shortcut make sure to run on minimized uh, window here and then go to compatibility uh, select this option this uh, run this program in compatibility mode for windows 8 and then also select here disable full screen optimization optimizations press apply okay and then you start your computer and try the game and the problem should be fixed right so that's pretty much it and if i help you out please press like button and subscribe for more take care bye